So all these other coaches and gurus out there really focus on these quick strategies. Get 100 leads today, get 10 clients in the next seven days, or how to make an extra $2,000 per week, as these are the pain points that most trainers will experience. If you're not already making you know, six figures, well, it's because, yeah, you haven't got enough leads, you don't have enough clients, and yes, you wanna make money. As a fitness business coach, I work with trainers worldwide on how to grow and being a six-figure business, and yes, quick success is great. I've been at this for many years now. While there is some truth to the fact that if your business you know, isn't succeeding, you need, yes, more sales and you need more leads, it's more to do with the fact that many trainers simply just don't have this right structure to grow or how to successfully manage their business at the level they wish to play at. The quicker, the better, the faster you can achieve something seems to be an inbuilt behavior. This is why so many weight loss clients can you know, achieve weight loss successfully very, very quickly, but eventually the weight keeps on creeping back on as they don't know how to manage the weight long term. This is also why trainers find it super hard to make more than $50,000 a year. Yeah, you had some quick success, you had heaps of clients, but you keep on finding yourself back at the beginning of wanting more clients and wanting more leads. I read that it's a fact that most lottery winners that you know win big, that 70% of them are broke in just a few years. What I'm getting at, it doesn't matter the example, whether it's weight loss or maintaining an average income for your PT business or lottery winners going broke. The distinctive attributes is that growth and success of a goal, you need to understand how to manage and play at that level to keep succeeding. So as a trainer, when you go through all the phases of you know, setting up a successful fitness business, we need to figure out your ambition and how you can gain and require the capabilities to succeed and ensure that if you get to that level, that you can maintain it. I'm very active when it comes to working with my clients. I love seeing that successful transformation of when a trainer focuses on what they need to be doing. It's easy to get lost and be stuck within your fitness business when you first start out. But with the right guidance, you know, the right support that we provide our members, we are consistently seeing results and success with everyone that applies what is needed. Our way of coaching is helping trainers easily break through their income barriers and maintaining that 50 to 60 session mark, building an online fitness business empire, hiring staff that works for them and making multiple six figures. Because together, we understand what is needed, what needs to be done to grow and how to manage and play at that level. My advice is don't waste your time guessing. It's a lot more fun having someone there with you in your business, helping you to guide you and showing you what needs to be done. And that person's also in the trenches of your unique business. Even if it isn't me, you know, you have another coach, another mentor. So you just need someone who's been in the industry to guide you. Make sure that you have someone that is willing to give you all the tools, all the knowledge, all the systems, the business plans, the guidance, the advice, the coaching, the PT software, just giving you everything to be successful.